Mass? Oh, that's quite simple. It's embarrassingly simple, really. We have uh, the horse meat, only one cut is a tenderloin, and we either pan fry it or we grill it, or you can have it raw as a steak tartare. It's really good for eating raw. And the, uh, for that particular reason as well, if the meat is cooked really rare, uh, it makes the quality of the meat stand out that much better. What defines the flavor or which makes it stand out from the rest is the fact that it um, contains a lot of glucose, which is a fast-burning sugar, and, uh, and iron. If you try to typify the, 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 the flavor, it leans more to game and big game, in fact. horse is never erased to be consumed, which means that a horse has led a fairly, or horse had a, a good quality life. Usually um, it's been a, a, a companion or a, or a working animal, either, either way, or a free running uh, or free living animal. Each time uh, horse meat comes uh, is, is being mentioned in the media, we usually we, we get reaction right away. We, we get much more customers. Dus people in Vilvoorde are called pierrefretters. That's uh, the same thing as in, in properly spoken Dutch as paardeneters. Uh, and it means uh, uh, yeah, that we are horse eaters. Uh, and it's my experience that most people who have tried it uh, will always choose uh, horse meat uh, above beef when they come a second time to, to Vilvoorde. Dat we de paarden niet mochten, hè? Je ziet dat? Ik had toch gelijk.